What's up everyone, Father Win Itachi here, you know what it is, thank you very much for tuning in to youtube.com slash Father Win Itachi, where today we're going to be continuing our adventures in Pokemon Quest, a game that we picked up the past couple of days on our channel, um, especially now that we are doing some live streams on mobile gaming. This game is actually really fun, and if you guys haven't checked out the first couple of live streams for this game, go ahead and check it out on the Father Win Itachi uh, Pokemon Quest playlist on our YouTube channel. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and click chat to start. Continue where we left off yesterday. I did um, go over the user interface and pretty much how the game works. So now we're going to go ahead and just quickly get into things and uh, see what we can do here. So first of all, if I remember correctly, if I go to the Pokemart, which is the top right, I should be able to collect some PM tickets because it's like a daily thing or 20 every 22 hour type thing. Uh, let's go ahead and see if anything was updated. I'm actually saving... Um, my PM tickets for a specific decoration. So I'll go ahead and show you guys what I want to purchase. Now, a lot of these decorations look really, really cool, but I did find out that the Mewtwo arc, in my eyes, most expensive thing here is the Kangaskhan thing. So what the hell does this do? Chance for Pokemon with a multi-socket times two. Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. But I did find the Mewtwo arc giving you extra battery life to go ahead and do um, expeditions is actually a much better thing than most of these. But again, I haven't looked at all of these. I just feel like the Mewtwo arc is pretty damn OP. So that means you get to play the game a lot more in one sitting than you would instead of having to wait. It's bad. It's better. I, I find the Mewtwo arc better for like free to play people like myself. Data backup. Ooh. Create data backup. You get a hundred tickets. Number of times PM tickets have been received from the shop. Oh, snap. So that means we've collected our daily twice. We're getting PM tickets up a storm, fam. And we're going to be able to purchase some cool decorations soon. So stay tuned for that. And the first decoration, as you guys can see, the, the three ratatats on top of each other. The bottom one actually looks like a raticate, but they look like three ratatats on top of each other. Those are from the, um, that's from completing the first expedition. So without further ado, ooh, this is new. What's up, Staryu? How's it going? Uh, so Staryu's now on the team at level 16. Oh, you know what's up. You know what's up. All right, so every now and then, you get to find a different Pokemon. So always make sure you're looking around and searching. So let's go ahead and edit our team here. Because that level 16 Staryu is OP compared to everything else that I got. I'm going to keep Eevee because that's the starting Pokemon. And it's just like you can't leave your starting Pokemon. So I'm going to go ahead and drag out. Wait, wait. Power Charms, real quick. You gotta take him off of my boy Slowpoke while he's pretty much useless. Um, take those off. Let's go back to the team. Is there a way to just go back? Uh, if I click the back button, does it take me back there? Or does it take me back to the... Okay, cool. Perfect. Let's go ahead and switch out Slowpoke for Staryu. Staryu's really, really high level, so that is interesting to see. Let's go ahead and hit up Power Charms on Staryu. Should be able to equip some of these. Uh, yes, I can equip both. I could have just put them both on there, but it doesn't really matter. Um, okay, so our level, team level, should be over a thousand by now. So, go ahead and click back. Go ahead and click back again. So, we're going to rock Vulpix, which is a fire type. Staryu, which is a water type. So, typings are covered. Oh, we still at a thousand and eight, roughly. And then we've also got Eevee, which is the normal type. So, kind of kind of can go any which way with that one um so right now we're gonna go ahead and hit up expeditions not too much more to do here what's up sylveon thank you very much for tuning in not too sure if you got my tweet yesterday but uh i hit you up with the sub favorite pokemon is of course sylveon i find that very interesting small world here um yeah my favorite pokemon has been sylveon ever since i've always liked the evolutions but sylveon is just like the cutest freaking thing of all times Absolutely love it, and it's so powerful too. Alright, so we're going on to Expedition 2, which has, I believe, four stages. I see two, one, two, 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 three, and I do see an additional one. Um, my team is only eight 
item level above the requirement of a thousand so hopefully we can oh bonus type 154 um, because it's fire I also get a bonus type from the star you I'm assuming so it is 1008 plus the 154 because star you is going to be able to do additional damage to the fire types so we're going to gloomy grove I did not expect to find some fire types here so let's go ahead and get started that's why I made my youtube page <laughs> I can tell. I can definitely tell. I've been watching some of the videos, especially the later ones. The latest ones are awesome. I absolutely love it. Huge fan of AMVs and then also uh, them being related to just Sylveon. That is just really cool. Oh, I forgot I switched out takedown for freaking growl. Oh no. An icy wind. Star you. Oh no. Star you. Why do you know an ice type move? You're a water type Pokemon. I brought you here for a reason. Wait. Oh! I had I have now the most popular YouTube page for Sylvia on AMVs. Ooh, I didn't even notice that. I saw you follow a couple of other um Evolution type AMV people, so that's very awesome. I actually like AMV, so it's pretty cool. My, uh, my intro for my YouTube channel is kind of an AMB for a different anime. I just realized I did a mistake here. Um, this level, because I was kind of confused why it would be uh, fire type, it is actually grass type, which makes sense. So I do apologize for that. And I'm getting the bonus from uh, Vulpix and as well as Staryu for having a nice type move against grass type Pokemon. So Staryu is actually doing some extra deeps. And we are also on the final stage of this level, for those of you wondering. So this is going very, very quickly. Got to take care of Gloom and a couple of Oddish here. I actually really, really like this game. And I love the fact that it has an auto auto feature. There's a lot of games on mobile that have auto features. I've played Summoner's War and I was actually questioning myself. Should I play Summoner's War and get back into that? Or should I go ahead and try out Pokemon Quest? I'm so happy I tried out Pokemon Quest. I'm a huge Pokemon fan. Have all the cards. Well, I have a lot of the cards, especially the old school ones. Really, really big into this game. Absolutely love Pokemon. I'm planning to do more, like, animations. Ooh, I would like to see that. Alright, let's see what we got here. So, start use OP. Not good at getting any levels there. We did get a Mighty Stone, but not too big, but it is a silver, and it does have a lot of attack, so that is decent. A lot of cooking regions, which is really, really nice. Alright, so with that being said, we did complete a quest. If you watch my latest video, did some effects by hand, I will definitely check it out after the live stream. Been meaning to get into that, but it's kind of confusing when I don't have a computer to watch YouTube, but I have time on my hands to watch YouTube after I'm done streaming on my phone, so that is definitely great. I might ask you a question about your AMVs too, especially if I find one that I really, really, really like. Um, can I go to base camp really quick just to check something, and then I'll be back to the next expedition, so bear with me here, guys. Um, don't really see too much cooking here. Like I'm more, I, I purchased, I recently purchased a Nintendo Switch mainly to get into more Pokemon because that's just like my thing. I've always, the stream got cut out. What was the question? Oh, that was weird. Um, I'm assuming the stream's still going on because you're watching it. But um, yeah, the question was, I mean, I'm basically getting into more Pokemon stuff on my channel and I'm hoping to continue that. And basically what I was going to say is if, you, if I found an AMV on your channel that I really, really liked, especially if it was a short one, like a really quick one, um, I was going to ask you if I could use it as like an intro and put your channel in the description box and all that stuff. Oh, this is another... Okay, so this whole thing's going to be around... I mean, I know Paris are also poison types, but it's going to be all basic... Oh, they're also bug types too. So, I mean, I guess it's... I guess it's a little bit diff different. Okay, yeah, this is more of a poison type field over here. Because now we got Executes and Paris. And uh, I guess I'm confusing myself here. Oddish and Gloom and uh, Vile Plume, they're also poison types. So I guess this is more of a poison type uh, expedition than grass. 
Especially since you're based around Sylveon and my Pokemon Trainers Club has Sylveon at number one. So that's like super positive for me. My t what are your top six? You planning more Pokemon content? That's so good. Yes, yes, yes. Um, especially Pokemon Let's Go. What are your top six Pokemon? I'm pretty sure you have a Pokemon Trainers Club account, so... What are your top six? <laughs> Let's see here. This level is actually really easy, even though I'm just... I think I'm just above it. I should have put on the stone, I believe. But we're doing this pretty quick. We don't have that much damage taken thus far, and of course... Our OP as Staryu is doing bits. Wait, when you say Pokemon Trainers account, uh, Pokemon.com. I'm... No, not this one. I'm talking about uh, Pokemon.com. If you don't have one, that's fine. I was just... Like, most people that play Pokemon have one, so... That's what I was just asking. Why can't I use Growl? Oh, okay, never mind. I got it. Yeah, Pokemon.com, I and mean, then you can usually like create like uh, mess around with your avatar and stuff like that, and then you can also like put your top six po or your top favorite six Pokemon on your account. <clears throat> you can you can use that account for like logins to things like Pokemon Go or the Pokemon trading card game online. Surprised we weren't able to do it here. <laughs> so uh, well, before you do it, then what are your top six? Ooh, we're actually facing off against an Executor. Nice. To be honest, I really didn't expect that. Executor is actually decently rare in the uh, the first generation of Pokemon. Not super rare, especially when you get to the Safari Zone, but decently rare. It's not a Pokemon you'll notice all the time. A lol and Executor, man. I'd like to see that in this game. I don't even think you'd see the top of its head. I know my top six. I'll tell you my top six if you tell me yours. Got a lot of cooking regions on this level, which is really, really nice right now. Should have used Growl by now, but, I mean, we're getting through this pretty quick. Let's go ahead and hit up with a Growl. Put a debuff on the, uh, the opponent here. Continue with Flail. Continue with Icy Wind. The top six are Sylveon. You gotta have an additional five. You can't have just... Like, if you were to play Pokemon, would you have a team of just six Sylveon? I mean, you can. I'm not gonna degrade you on that, but I mean... I mean, my favorite is Sylveon, so I'm not gonna hate. Also, sorry, I didn't reply. Stream doesn't allow to chat too much. Or Oh, I know. That's, a, that's the one thing I hate about YouTube. Don't worry. Don't worry. I got you. I understand YouTube on that sense. Oof! For a bronze mighty stone, that is actually pretty good. Plus 105 attack, plus 6.2 critical damage. And of course, like I said earlier, a lot of cooking regions. And we got a silver sturdy stone. We got a couple stones to uh, add to our Pokemon, so I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. Um, let's see here. We did complete a quest. Okay. Well, I'm a huge fan of the evolutions as well. Uh, two long range, one close range. Book berries. Sweet. I mean, if to be honest, I agree. Absolutely 100% agree with you on that. If I was to have a team in Pokemon, it'd be all Eeveelutions. Like, no lie, that, that's just easy. That's why I started with Eevee here in this game, because absolutely my favorite Pokemon. If you mean Pokemons that aren't Eeveelutions, yes, let's go with that. Uh, what are your favorite besides the Eeveelutions? Yeah, Alolan Vulpix, especially, I mean, Alolan Vulpix is uh, the snowy white one absolutely one of the cutest Pokemon in the game but um yeah the reason why if I were to grade the evolutions in order my top three would be so Sylve I mean they don't even it can be Eevee as well my top three would be Sylveon of course number one it's my favorite Pokemon in the game I'd go with Eevee at number two I would honestly put Eevee over any of the rest because Eevee's so freaking cool and then oh yes I agree with that and then what else? Flareon would have to be my third favorite. But it's so hard to choose. It's so hard to choose when it comes to the evolutions. I mean, Glaceon, Letheon, Vaporeon, they're all freaking amazing. 
All right, we're going to power up the team, and we're going to do this big time. It is so hard, except number one and number two for me are always going to be, um, what's it called, Sylveon and Eevee. <clears throat> but when it comes to my top six, like my top six if I was to have a battle team or a battle squad, of course, number one, it would all be Eeveelutions. But if I was to really dive in and I could only use one Eeveelution, it'd be Sylveon, uh, Charizard, Blastoise, Venusaur, Dragonite, and Gardevoir. Well, for the first, always Sylveon. Always Sylveon. I agree. Ooh, 1237 is the, uh, the team level right now. Let's get into the next expedition here. I really like Gardevoir as well. Female Gardevoir. Uh, so we got a bonus type of plus 251 as well as 1237. So we're a little bit below the requirement for this one. So let's go ahead and see what we got. I've seen Smog Celestila used in um, competitive Pokemon as well. So I agree with you there. Let's see here. So I'm going to, I can't put this on auto. I'm going to have to do this myself. So let's start off with a massive growl here. Icy wind into a charm. Volpix, you're going to need to learn an additional move for me. If you want to go ahead and be competitive for me. I'm using you because you're cute. And I really, really like Volpix. But uh, besides just being able to use charm, you're going to have to be able to do some more bits for me. So hurry up. Learn a move. I played WoW before. Also, we indeed have a lot in common. <laughs> yeah, I've played WoW for 13 years. That's like my main game. It'll never switch. But I want to make my channel like a 50. But the games that I play, I want to split it between like a 50-50 with PC games and uh, Nintendo games. So I want like Pokemon to start taking its course into my channel rotation and of course I'm never gonna leave World of Warcraft because that's just like my thing I've always played it and then what else like of course I'll play other different games as well I quit it in Legion oh why is that I'm kind of pissed off that I'm not in pre-patch right now but right now the first week of BFA pre-patch there is no content so I'm not missing anything but my computer does not arrive in Florida until the 24th. So, yeah, I'm going to miss a lot of the pre-patch. So hopefully that's not the case. Ooh, this is a lot of Oddish. We're going to have to deal with this quick. My poor Eevee's taking brunt force damage right now. I agree with you. Uh, World of Warcraft does take a lot of time up. That's why I kind of play casually now. I used to be in a top 50... I, s I used to do uh, PvP a lot and some PvE. Oh, I'm core PvE. I, mean, I used to raid in a top 50 uh, world guild back in BC, Wrath, and Kata. We kind of went... We used to raid six days a week, six hours a day. And that was just like... That was our thing for three expansions straight. Six hours a day, six days a week. And that just took such a toll on all of us. Uh, we kind of stayed together, uh, most of us, and went casual from um, Mr. Pandaria up until Legion. And Legion, most of us just quit and either went to a different game or went super casual, which is what I do now. I just play the game on my own time. But it's cool. I get to get different things done. I do pet battles. I do PvP. I do PvE. I did raid a lot and miss Mr. Pandaria. A lot of people were not liking it when it was out. Looking back on it, one of the best expansions ever put into the game. Eevee, I am really, really not wanting you to die right now. Shaman Heroic. Oof. Yes. What was your main in World of Warcraft? What is that? What is that? Eevee, Eevee died. Eevee died. It's in a Pokeball. What do we do? Complete the level for the boy Eevee. Damn, okay, I'm just sorry. Oh, mo okay, you're one of those. Oh, no. Volpix died too. 1v1, Weeping Bells OP. Oh, no. Run away, run away. Um, I think Eevee's back. Oh, they come back after a certain time. Oh, start off with Growl, my G. Run away. My main was a Druid, DK, and Shaman. Ah, I see. 
Yeah, I've played Warlock my whole entire WoW career. Uh, we need a quick uh, Icy Wind. Uh, reapply Growl, please. Reapply Charm. Get back into Icy Wind. But I do play other characters as well. Uh, hit it up with a Flail. Oh no. Eevee, you're back into the L zone. Yes! We completed the level. That was actually a lot more difficult than I thought. Hopefully we get a good one. I will try Classic. Oh, definitely, definitely. Alright, let's see. So we got no... We do got an extra slot on Staryu. And Eevee has now an extra slot. We got a Sturdy Stone with uh, HP and a couple of Cooking Regions. We didn't get too much from that level, so that kind of sucks. See what quests we've completed. I was so young when Classic Raw was alive. I am in the same boat. I never played when Classic Raw. Well, I mean, I started at the end, so I have no, I can't say anything about it. I started right before BC got launched. Alright, so we've got some work to do here. I know Eevee has a slot that we can take care of. Boost you up to the max. Uh, Vulpix. Sorry about that. Vulpix got nothing. Star you. Do you got any? Uh, no, you do not. Okay, so that's all we can do right now. Let's go ahead and exit that. Ah, what is that? What did you do? I've been in almost every beta. Except, of course, original, because I never played then, and I was not in BC beta, but ever since Wrath, I've been in beta. Alright, so. Of course, we got all day. <laughs> Alright, so we got this, 2-4. Oh, so there's five levels in this one. Again, we're struggling because we do not have... Yeah, we don't have enough. Alright, we're going to have to do some training here. I'm going to have to go back to base camp. I want to make this as easy as possible. I really hate doing this. But we're going to have to do it. Um, how do you do this again? Is it in edit team? I used to haunt for bugs in WD beta. And at some time I found some crazy things. Oh, back then. For sure. Were they bad things that you did? Or just like normal? Alright, so here's training. We gotta be able to do this. I'm sadly gonna get rid of my slowpoke for this though. I decided to play a lot of the beta and had an idea. <laughs> I'm interested. So we're gonna go ahead and bring up Eevee here. Put in slowpoke. I really need to get rid of growl. 11% success rate. That is not good. But Eevee will level up? No, it won't. Hmm. That sucks. Well, we'll take the 11% and take the XP for now. I used an exploit to enter the PvP servers where there are no PvE content, but my character was full geared with P- Ooh. Not supposed to appear. Alright, so I didn't get the 11% uh, chance. That sucks. Sorry, Slowpoke, but you were used. I used glitches to spawn enemies and, well, some other crazy things. <laughs> Did you put videos on these? Alright, let's go ahead and attempt this. And boom. Screenshots. Ooh. If you made videos on that, that would have been some. That would have been some stuff. Alright, start off with a flail. This is just the basics, so I'm not going to go ahead and focus too much on growl. And I'm really upset that I have Volpix here right now. Volpix has, has just been pretty much useless for me. Staryu's been carrying the squad big time. Go ahead and move out of this. And well, so I asked everyone in Orgrimmar to mount around. <laughs> so you did some big maneuvers. What else happened next? No potions in this game, I've noticed. Ooh, Pikachu! That's kind of interesting. That's kind of rare to see around in these parts.
This area that we're actually in right now kind of reminds me of Viridian Forest. But you're seeing like all the rare spawns in Viridian Forest. Use my exploit macro. And, oh my gosh. So you downed the servers on beta. Oh, okay, I see what you did. I, I got you, I got you. Oh my gosh, this Pikachu's killing me. Pikachu, go away. I need to down this. Alright, so we're only on step three. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, I've never done anything that crazy. Oh, I heard about that. I did hear about that. I heard about the TP bug. Alright, continue on. I believe, yes, this is the final phase. Oh, we're facing obviously a Parasect with Paris. So this is not going to be good. This might be our first L of this game, guys. It's going to be interesting. Start off with Charm. I'm trying to get rid of these Paris as quickly as possible. I'm going to have to start making some maneuvers. Some vehicles that worked outside the quest zone. Okay, let's go ahead and make some maneuvers. Please run away, guys. Please run away. He's trying to stay alive. Flail in. Icy wind. Yeah, this is not looking good at all. I was the one that started the... Oh my gosh. Yeah, I actually remember that. Oh, no, 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 no. Run away, run away, run away. Oh, I lost. So, yeah, Wad, uh, you are all out of Pokemon. You can use PM tickets to collect the items you found along the way. No. I give up. Do you want to give up on XP? You'll lose. Yes. That's my first loss in this game. Do we get XP? Ooh, we actually get XP. Okay, this is just like Pokemon would do. Perfect. So now, if I did that, a loss in an expedition counts as... Okay, that's actually good. Challenge. Grass investigation. Receive. What's up, Barstool? Receive, Big Root. I wish I could feed my puppers. Alright, so with base camp being set... You're already at 50k, bro! Yeah, it's actually easy to make gold right now. Alright, so with that being said, we're able to... Yeah, a loss in an expedition actually goes counts towards your cooking pot. <laughs> oh, a new dish. I don't focus on gold at all, and I was able to get gold, so... You Gucci right now, but in BFA it's not going to be as easy. Uh, mud pie a la cube. Ground types. This isn't what I'm looking forward to. Wait, what the fuck is that? Onyx? Did I just see an Onyx, dude? Oh my gosh. We got an Onyx. This, oh, it's only level... What is this game? What is this game? Only level 7. What is this? Video game, please. Allow me to get Pokemon that are, like, really OP. Onyx is cool, but still... Oh my gosh, I only got 370 PM tickets. This is getting a really long grind in this game. Alright, so let's see what I can do here. Um, pulling up Eevee really quick. Can I really not add this stone to anyone? Alright, I cannot. Okay, good to know. Let's see here. Gotta be able to get through this next adventure. Am I gonna have to... I might have to do something else. Hold up here. Edit team. So now if I was to train. I want to just see the percentage of uh, a move. Are you horde? I am both. But if I'm going to be honest. I'm mostly for the first. At 28% I'm not going to take it. Yes I took 11% earlier. But Onyx is actually pretty damn cool. Um. I play Forsaken, that has been my main, but I do have uh, max levels of almost every 
um, racing class in the game. I'm just missing Shaman and Warrior because I'm just I've been too lazy to level them up. But I'm mostly for the Forsaken, if any, if any, <clears throat> I can't even speak, if anything, I'm mostly for the Forsaken, but yeah, I do play both. Um, let's see here, 370, can I purchase anything goo? What does Charizard do? Size of red, ingredient drops, don't really want that. Flurry on cushion, side of red, ingredient drops, blue, blue. Yellow, yellow, gray. So these are the drops, and I really could care less about drops right now. Uh, XP received, nice. XP received, nice. Success rate of moves, that's definitely needed. Ingredients, ingredients. Oh, so you can recycle. Okay, that's nice. Multi sockets. I need, I need the Mewtwo arc. If anything, the Mewtwo arc is like the most OP thing from this game. I have to save. I'm going to force myself to save that. So, 1343. We have increased just a bit. So, let's go ahead and check it out really quick. I might have to start doing some 3 dash ones, but, or um, Expedition 3. Ooh, I forgot something here. We got to put some cooking into the pot. Uh, just go ahead and auto set. I mean, what is this? Yeah, just go ahead and auto set. I'm not really stingy right now. Later in the game, I can force myself to cook specific items of uh, specific foods, but to get specific Pokemon. But right now, no. So, if I add 252 to 343. That's 250, so that's 1590, <laughs> no chance. All right, so let's go ahead and do some um, Expedition 3 for now. So this is a bonus type, would be Grass. I do not have the bonus type, but I do have enough to go ahead and clear this. So let's do it and get some experience points. I could go back and probably get a nice decent drop rate. From the first expedition, but I'm trying to just grind my way forward without having to take steps back for right now. Let's go ahead and put this one on auto and see. We haven't done one of those today. Ooh, magic card. This should be quickly easy dealt with. These are all I'm assuming all they know is splash. Yeah, they're really not doing any damage. <laughs> easy walking through this in the park fam. But for those of you tuning in, while this one is on auto, thank you all very much for tuning in to youtube.com slash for the one is Hachi. Got questions, post in the comment section or live stream chat, and I'll be sure to answer as soon as possible. Facing off against some slow poking crabbies for round two of this expedition. Uh, Magikarp and the classic splash all day, every day. And then, um, yeah, for those of you tuning in, check out the description box. you find tons of goodie links down there. Um, from our about section to social media to sponsors to our schedule and of course donations but if you guys want to go ahead and um, how you got so many subs well first of all you should ask that to MW Sylveon second of all me I've been doing YouTube for quite some time um, mostly World of Warcraft people are subscribed to my channel but I'm looking forward to expanding into Pokemon and of course continuing with my other hobbies such as soccer and stuff but, um, yeah, I mean, I've been doing it for quite some time. Hopefully I can continue to grind. Hopefully I can continue to grow. This is not a full-time job for me. I just do this at night. But I'm looking at doing it for fun in the near future if I can continue to grow this channel. But Sylveon, on the other hand, has 17,000 subs. So, Sylveon, how did you get so many subs? <laughs> But yeah, if you guys want, go ahead and check out the description box. Tons of goodie links. We also got our 24-hour live stream information down below in the description box as well. Oh, right. You like soccer. You are from England, right? I am from Wales, which is south of England. I can tell it's a lot of work. I know, I know the work it took me to get 1,000 subs. That was A lot of work was just 100 subs. The beginning is the slowest part. But yeah, I got you. Vulpix taking some L's against the water types right now. I feel sad. Eevee and Staryu, you gotta protect. Ooh, we're already facing off against a Slowbro. 
Four slow pokes and a slow bro. This is gonna be looking interesting. Like my next thing in order to grow my channel would be to like collab with other gamers. That's like my thing. That's what I'm trying to do. Cause to be honest, I'm kind of in a in a standstill point to where I'm not gaining that many views on my videos. It's mainly my streams that kind of get the decent amount of views. I'm just trying to build up some Fortnite content, Warcraft content, and some Overwatch. I play World of Warcraft and Overwatch. I used to play Fortnite. I did a world's first video in Fortnite. Got not that many views. A month later, someone named Lachlan, who I do know. I've watched his videos. And uh, he did the exact same thing I did a month later. Got a million plus views on it last I checked. And uh, that kind of pissed me off. So I stopped playing Fortnite. And I wasn't really a fan of Fortnite. <clears throat> Yeah, I did a I did a world's first Fortnite video. It was the um, back when Fortnite first came around the scene. It was what's it called? Uh, it was basically you win without doing anything, and he kind of cheated it. He was using mats and materials. I absolutely used nothing. Abs, I used absolutely nothing. No, no mats, no ammo, no weapons, nothing, and I still got the dub. And it was like a world's first thing back then, but sadly, I couldn't get the video out there. I just didn't know what to do. I tried, I tried like putting it out on Reddit. Of course, I use social media all the time. I don't hate Lachlan. He does. His, oof! Oh my gosh! A golden sturdy stone. Time to recover minus ten. HP upon recovery, 5.5. .5. Movement speed, plus 15. Australian accent, he's annoying. Well, makes him sound like a pussy. Okay. What, um, do you know who the Sidemen are? I mean, they're kind of friends with Lachlan, but the Sidemen, they're like big YouTubers. So, how do you hit base camp? That is definitely a rare drop. I'm super stoked to add this. Alright, sweet. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, go to Eevee. I, I want to put it on Eevee because Eevee's like my thing. I'm a, I am I like the Sidemen. So what's your take on them? If you don't like accents. Uh, they're not Warforged Stones. They're kind of just like... It's just randomized on the, uh, the stats that they get. And there's different colorations or variations of drops. Like uh, in World of Warcraft, you get Uncommon Common... Uh, rare epics and stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we got a 99 golden. Let's go ahead and see. I want to see where I want to equip this right now. Put it here. Go ahead and equip this. You know what? I got this. I'm going to have to reset my... I'm going to live stream again to YouTube. Ooh. Alright, I'm going to reset all of my... Uh, my stones because I want all the epic ones on Toxic Pyro Gaming has my main uploads. We'll keep it there, fam. Alright, let's see what we got here. So let's go ahead and drop the 99 gold, of course. The 102 is pretty decent. Let's go ahead and drop an 86. No, 105. Yes, the 105 with a crit. So Eevee is like ultra OP right now. So that's a 102, 70. Okay, so Eevee's doing some bits. Could drop in a movement speed, but that 102 is just next level. I hope you get it recovered, bro. Alright, so let's go ahead and check this out. Vulpix. Um, you're just going pure attack, but what really sucks is you don't know any good moves. <laughs> so you know what? I'm going to drop you the shitty stones. I do apologize, but you don't deserve any good stones when you don't have any good moves. But I'm giving you something for the time being. Let's see, Star You. Star You can get some beasts. Yeah, Star You, you're gonna get the beast moves. Perfect. So that's the best my team can be at this moment in time. 1463. Still not there. But we're getting there. We're getting close. Back to expeditions. Let's see what we got. Oh, I can also look at quests. Alright, real quick. Quests. I can now I can check myself if they're dailies or not. 
Okay, no, nope, they're not dailies. They're one-time things. All right, cool. Good to know. So once you've completed all the main challenges and all that stuff, uh, they pretty much don't come back. I'm double-checking on challenges now. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so none of these are dailies. They're one-time things. So main achievements and challenge achievements. Once you've completed them, that's pretty much it. So hopefully they add some more in the near future. Let's go ahead and do Expedition 3-2. Because um, we're not ready for 2-4 just yet. And bonus type is grass. I don't have. But we should be able to handle this. I believe this is my last expedition I can do for the time being as well. I did not check on the timer, so we'll figure that out when we get out here. Facing off against Tentacool, as well as Poliwag. Poliwag look absolutely interesting when they're in cube form. <laughs> they actually look pretty similar to what they would normally look like anyways. I don't even have to bother with Growl on Eevee because I have Volcakes. But if I really wanted to, especially against squads like this and not just a boss, spamming Growl and Charm kind of is decent maneuvers, but it's not the best. Wave 1 out of 3 cleared. Let's continue on. I'm, sh I'm absolutely shocked. I'm playing... I'm, I'm actually streaming on a cell phone right now. Never thought this would this would happen, but I'm glad it is because just saw another stone. Yee! Saw that. I'm interested. I'm I'm actually glad I'm streaming on mobile uh, cell phone. Ooh, Tentacruel. Okay, this game doesn't this game doesn't mess around. We're seeing all the Pokemon in this game as quickly as possible. But, um, yeah, I'm kind of happy I'm streaming on a mobile device because it actually gets me to try new things. I wish I could stream Pokemon Go, but sadly it would appear with black bars on the side because it's vertical. What's up, Terraria guys? How's it going? Thank you very much for tuning in. That's a mini tentacle. <laughs> What's up? What am, what am I guessing? Wait, the boss called for help. Oh, snap, crackle, and pop, boys. You gotta deal with this now. You got some tentacles. Oh my gosh. What's, welcome back, Toxic Pyro. Why do you got another account, my book, my G? Why do you got so many? <laughs> you got so many YouTube accounts. I, it's so hard to keep track of you. Wait, did you recover your account? And they changed the name? Oh my gosh. Terraria guides. Oh. Oh, okay, no, I got you, I got you. Oh my gosh, Star, you actually died. <gasps> I almost lost. Oh my gosh. So I just figured out, first time, um, if you kill the boss, the, uh, the other enemies go away. Interesting. Mighty Stone plus 99 attack. That is actually pretty decent for a Silver Stone, so I might use it. Completed another quest. Ooh, Moby's item detection. As you've continued on your expedition, Moby's ability to detect items has improved. It will now be temporarily able to find more items. Just for this next expedition, Moby will uh, definitely be able to find a rare power stone with some special... Oh, I gotta be able to complete this next expedition. Alright, challenge. Tumble cube. Aw, oh, dude, this game knows. This game knows I needed the battery charge. Thanks, game. It just wants me to continue playing tonight. That's what that was. Alright, so again, I did say I have to do some maneuvers. Let's just check if there's any Pokemon. No, I don't see anything, really. Okay. Let's see. What are we going to do here? EV first. So that's the 105 with the crit. That's the 102 and the 99. 
uh, hit up Staryu and then Volpix. That's the order of my Pokemon right now, even though Staryu is my most powerful. Switch that out. 64 and a 59, but they're not, no extras, so let's go ahead and hit up, uh, sorry about that. Miss Pushed. When do you started your channel? Um, so I started the channel in, if I go to my page, I believe it tells me 2010, but I did not make videos then. One second here. Yeah, I didn't make videos back in 2010. I started making videos in 2012. That was when I was doing, like, the rating and all that stuff. What is this? Expedition bonus. Oh, I see. So the next... Oh, I get it. So when the expedition bonus bar fills up, you're about to get some stuff. Um, the webcam, I actually got rid of it. Um, it was kind of laggy and slow, especially because it's a mobile device webcam. And, uh, yeah. So, um, basically, I started in 2010. 2012, I created videos. And then, um, I kind of deleted all the videos. And then I brought it, and then I went to college and just stopped YouTube altogether. But I continued watching it and followed it. And welcome back. And, um, I hope you don't mind the non-webcam thing. That's, uh, to me, I'm gonna use the webcam in PC games. Keep mobile games as simple as possible. And if it is a mobile game that could really require a webcam like Pokemon Go, I'll definitely bring it in. But then um, I create, I restarted the channel completely fresh in 2016 towards the end. So basically 2017. So I've been running it and got uh, to where I'm at today in about a year, just over a year and a half. So 3-3 only requires 1600. However, 2-4... I have a bonus of 241. So hyped. I can't believe I got my name and everything. <laughs> Congratulations on getting it back, my G. So 2-4 with the 1512 and the bonus, I should be able to continue back on uh, Expedition 2. So let's go ahead and try this again. Yeah, it, the, the more I continue to grow this channel, the more I can actually do... So I'm looking forward to do uh, looking forward to seeing where this en ends up taking me. Cuz of course I would like to continue doing more stuff, but at the moment I don't make any money off of this. Nothing gets monetized, so I just do this for pure fun. And uh yeah, downloading and, and my, uh, my recording and streaming software. What do you use? OBS? I'm assuming. But yeah, basically the more I can continue to grow this channel, of course, the more I'm going to be able to do. So for those of you tuning in, you're new around here, hit the sub button and uh, help us out. Go ahead and continue with this. This actually, this stage is so much easier than it was early. Oh no, wait, hold up. Why did Star you take so much damage? What's going on here, boys? I said this was very easy. I need a potion, fam. I need a hyper potion. Alright, start off with a big icy wind. Twitch, I use OBS. Oh, I see, I see. Oh man, this is bad. I'm not going to be able to complete this. Move, move, move. No! I want to be able to beat the level, boys. I actually have the, the buff, but stupid Volpix doesn't know any moves. Staryu, you, you got to stay in the back, my G. No, run away, run away. Let's, let's, let's buy us some time right now. Alright, now everything's off cooldown. Go ahead. Volpix, you're so freaking useless. You're supposed to be the, the buff. Oh, no. No! We're gonna lose. Sorry, you, you really gotta... You gotta pull through. Oh, I'm done. God damn it. Again. Oh, I can't get through this level. Are you serious? Um... This sucks. Uh, if I give up, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see, this is my second loss, this is my second L fam. Oh no. Alright, Volpix, you need to level and you need to learn some moves. That's all I, okay, cool, I can finally add a slot. Oh, it's a, it's a needed slot too. Okay, let's do this, we're gonna do some power training here. 
get Volpix up to this par. Okay, the expedition bonus does stay, so that is good to hear. Get back to base camp. Okay, so with that being said, I'm going to try something. I, I'm not wasting PM tickets on this, so let's go ahead and hit up Eevee. <laughs> uh, hit up Star you real quick. Okay, with that being said, I'm going to have to do a little switch here. Because having this is kind of pointless. So go back. Go to Star you. Add this. Because it's a weightless zone. Uh, move wait time on Icy Wind is just, just pure genius. Volpix. I can add a plus 64 or a plus 59. That's movement speed. I'll just take the plus 64 for now. Uh, what else do we got here? I'm trying to make my team good enough to go ahead and complete this expedition, so bear with me here. I might have to do some uh, training. Yo, what's up? Alright, let's do this. Let's go ahead and check out some training. Well, I mean, I can't get on Bnet. I mean, I do. I can get on the app, but you're going to have to add me. Oh, more PM tickets. Nice. Oh, bingo from adding my stones in. I got you. Alright, so I'm at 1578. Oh, no worries. Hope to see you around. Uh, let's see. For the Winatachi, hashtag 1571. I'll go ahead and type it. For the Winatachi, hashtag 1571. Send. Please. Did that get sent? No. Send. Yeah, I didn't know I can type until now. I just figured out this app allows me to type in live stream chat. Nice. Okay, so we're going to have to edit team, I think. I think that takes me to training. Yep. I might have to do some training maneuvers here. I'm going to just check this out really quick. Okay, Eevee, you really... Okay, I'll look at it. I don't have it open right now. Wait, so you've already sent... I don't have it, though. I don't have anything pending. Wait, hold up. Can Volpix not learn anything? Oh wait, we're bringing this in. Success rate, 31%. I gotta try this. I'm sorry, Onyx, but... I'll get another one of you. I wanna change that. I, I don't need Growl. I need some fire reaction. 31% chance of learning some fiery new stuff. Yes! We've learned something. Oh, no. I didn't learn anything. This game just lied to me. Don't tell me. That's still growl. Yep, that's still growl. Oh, this game's cheating. This game's cheating me right now. I might. I should have probably just done it on Eevee. Oh, well. <sighs> Alright, so what is it? How many more? I believe I'm three out of four expeditions on this cooking. Yeah, one more expedition. We can go ahead and learn another or find another Pokemon to tame for the crew. 1578. I wasn't able to do the 1700. Let's go ahead and try the 1600. See what we can do here. This is not looking good right now. You know what's good about not having a webcam on though? Since it's so hot. I'm able to just like live stream laying on my bed with a fan on and shirtless. This is only level two and three. Why is this game getting harder? Why couldn't I start like my, my first attempt? I got a level 13 Growlithe off of the first Pokemon I saw. After the uh, the Rattata and the Pidgey, 
and that Growlithe had the best move set. The only thing positive about this so far is the um the ultra rare stone that Eevee's rocking. I right, start off with a nice win now. Flail in, keep it up with the charm. How far are you in this game, Sylveon? Okay, this is not looking good. Bullpix, you are ruining me right now. You're so useless. <clears throat> if anyone needs to die first, it's you, Bullpix, and I don't want to say that to be mean. Oh, you haven't started it yet. I see. It's actually a pretty fun game. I'm not gonna lie. I was kind of skeptical at first, because it didn't look so super fun. But it's such an easy and fun to play game, I, I like it. Growlithe definitely is strong, especially if I was able to get it to Arcanine. But what is this? I've completed steps 1 and 2. Oh, here we go. Boss stage. But we haven't faced the boss yet. What's up, TR1802? How's it going? Thank you very much for tuning in. Yeah, Arcanine is kind of broken. Uh, he's one of my favorite Pokemon, but not there yet. Of course, of course. I like our canine too. Alright. This is not too bad. I mean, it's looking decent. I'm, I'm, oh, wait, no. No. Wait. Okay, it's... Oh, gold duck. Oh, no. This could be bad. Start off with a quick icy wind. Start off with a growl. Run away. Run away. Debuff. Oh, nice. Oh! You can use that ability to avoid. Oh, my gosh. I need to learn today. Avoid, avoid. Just learned something new in this game. So the movement ability, you can also use that to avoid attacks, oncoming attacks. Apply growl and move, because he's about to attack right now. Eevee, don't stand there. That's bad stuff. Move, because both of you have cooldowns anyways. Eevee, stop. Eevee! I don't want you to die, Eevee. Alright, Vulpix, welcome back. You can take over the... Uh, the debuff with your charm now while Eevee can attack. So I'm surprised, but we're gonna be able to complete this level. Even though we had a lower and a disadvantage of basically team comp wise. Trade sub with me. I'll definitely check your channel out after the live stream. Let's see here. Oh! Oh yeah, of course, the expedition bonus. We got another golden stone. Alright, please level up, Eevee. Thank you. Welcome to level 10. No additional gem slots just yet. However, what is this Ultra Stone we are able to get? A 103 Sturdy Stone. HP upon recovery plus 6. Movement speed plus 18. Time to recover. Oh, that is nasty. That is really nasty. Alright, sweet. So they're both on level 4. So 2-4, 3-4... Let's go ahead and check out what we got from the cooking. Let's see here. First of all, let's deal with the stones. Oh, what's up, YM Gaming? How's it going? Why do you got Tall Terrace as your name now? Eevee, I want you to be as great and OP as possible, so take it. Uh, 105 is the strongest on that. I want my EV to be the strongest on my squad. Alright, so 102s. Oh, what are you streaming now, YM? What do you got? Um, Actually, let's go ahead and reset. I gotta redo this because there's one that is a mistake here. I'm gonna have to pull these gemstones off real quick. 158 comments in live stream tonight. Everybody going ham today. Oh yeah, you told me about that. Alright, let's start off with Eevee. Alright, perfect. Both of the legendary stones are on Eevee. I'm super happy to get those. Go ahead and hit up Eevee with the mighty stone. 
Star U is definitely going to need the decent stones as well. So let's go ahead and hit it up with a 107 and a 102. And of course, we got a 99 that we can trade you. Uh, hit up Vault Picks with everything that is left. Let's see here. So we got an 86, an 83, and an 81. And of course, a 93, which isn't bad at all. So let's go ahead and check out the current level of the squad. Should be higher now. Especially with the next uh, legendary. Yeah, 1650. So we're getting there. Let's see what Pokemon we attract from this. Can we learn a new recipe, please? Nope. We got a good Mulligan Stew a la Cube. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, close that. What the hell? Is that a seal? That looked like a seal. Hope Eevee gets stronger so he's more safe. I don't do that people sub if they want. Yeah, I got you. What? Oh, what? A level freaking one seal? Oh, I'm getting gypped so hard right now. Oh my gosh, that is so sad. A level one seal. I'm not even going to get rid of you. Because I have no reason to train you right now. Or use you for training. I don't get anything out of it. Alright. I want to auto set on a random start cooking. Alright, Toxic. So, out of get a complete five expeditions to go ahead and get that completed. Let's see how many more we can get through. The next L will close it for the night. So, 1700 is the easier one. 1650 plus the 288 so we're we're over the 1700 now i've tried attempting to do this level myself twice i'm gonna see if auto can complete this for me boom turn on auto i'm not even gonna deal with it let's see if the the computer or the pc is better than me but what sucks is the bonus that we get is from volpix but Volpix doesn't know any fire moves. So technically we don't have a bonus. I just need Eevee to do a lot of damage. And Staryu to back up. And Volpix just to take the damage. But we are getting pretty far in this game, so that is definitely a positive. I do want to complete Expeditions 2 and 3 today. Or at least get to both of the boss fights. So then the next live stream that we do this, we can go ahead and uh, start off straight away with two boss fights, which would be really nice. Alright, so we got health. The health regen in between fights is just so OP. Where does someone get this game? Um, you can actually download this in on your mobile device, or you can play it on Nintendo Switch. It is a free-to-play game, so very, very fun. I definitely recommend getting it. I just started playing this yesterday. Absolutely loving streaming this game. Absolutely loving playing this game. It's such a simple game. Huge Pokemon fan right here, and it's just been really good. Sadly, Eevee's poisoned right now and just got defeated. Oh, this is not good. Eevee, I'm going to need you. I'm going to need you so bad. Volpix, why are you so useless to me? Volpix. Learn a fire move. Staryu's taking the damage, Volpix. No. Eevee, I'm going to need you to come back. Yes, Eevee's back in action. I'm ready to roll. Do some bits, Eevee. We gotta get rid of the Parasis first. Stop focusing on the Parasite. Thank you. If we get rid of the Parasis first, we take less damage, fam. Oh, this is actually looking good. I think the computer is better than me at this game. However, I have noticed the computer does not use the running away tactic that I have. So, I don't even know what's going on. But if you are looking at these numbers, Eevee is pulling out some massive damage right now. It looks like they got this. I'm surprised Volpix is never in the front lines. Never. Uh, Staryu, um, what are you doing? Get in the front lines, please. I don't want Eevee to, uh, oh, we actually completed the level. 
Congratulations, me. Uh, you absolutely did nothing, me, except set up the squad. So we got 14 cooking reagents as well as a stone. Let's see what type of stone we got here. Sturdy stone, 137. Nice. Ooh, that's a lot of cooking reagents. We're going to be cooking up some good stuff soon. I wonder how you get the legendaries in this game. Quests. Let's see what we got. Is it a mission or a quest? It's a challenge. Okay, never mind. Bugs. Alright, get back to base camp real quick. Pop a little extra stonage in here so I can go ahead and increase the squad's level. Um, might. I don't think I'm going to be doing it on Eevee because Eevee's got the most powerful ones anyways. So it was a 137 and I do not want that just yet. Wait, 137 HP? The additional stats from these legendaries are just so powerful, so I'm going to keep those. Star you, I'm assuming you want the 137 over the 102. Oh, I love how they put them in order. Okay, I've just noticed that. Nice. And in Vulpix, you can take the 102. Nice. So with that being said, that is the team. Let's see what our new item level is or team level. 1694. So we're almost at 1700. We're going to have to do some maneuvers on this. Check to see if we've uh, recruited any additional Pokemon to the squad. I don't see any. And we have 375 PM tickets. I need more. I need more PM tickets. At least every day we get plus 50, I think. I'm pretty sure it's the same every single day. So, <sighs> hold up. Your boy's got Google dollars. I've got Google dollars. Hold up. Let's see what this is. Mini Expedition Pack. Chances of attracting multiple Pokemon with your cooking. Bonus A. Level 1 Pikachu with a special move. Bonus B. PM tickets 200. Even if you do not purchase this product, you will be able to exchange for the Pikachu surfboard with PM tickets after 72 hours have passed. If you purchase this product, you will not be able to exchange PM tickets for it. Note, even if there is some difficulty that prevents the purchase temporarily, you will no longer be able to put... Okay. Hold up here. Expedition pack. So if I purchase... Oh, hell no. 30 bucks for this? Nah, that's not my style, fam. I don't spend money that much money on the game. What do these stones do? It's a sharing stone. Oh, okay. So these are just stones. I mean, I don't really need those right now. Not a fan. Not a fan of the stones. You don't really know what they do. So you got an expedition, a great, and an ultra. Need a range with special moves. Oh my gosh. I really want to purchase something, but it's so expensive. I don't know what to do. Oh, hold up. That's an all-in-one bargain deal. That's all the three packs in one. So if I add this up, 18 plus 10, that's 28, 29, 31, 32, 30, about 33. Oh, so you're only saving a couple bucks. So it's ten, yeah, it's 10% off. That makes sense. I see now. I kind of want to buy the mini Pikachu thing. Let's see. One dollar credit from Google. One ninety nine. Oh hell yeah, boys! Y'all know what's up. I hope this isn't. Oh yes! Ha ha! I actually purchased it. That is interesting. So I got that Pikachu surfboard. Ride my surfboard. I got the 200 PM tickets. That was free, by the way, for me. It only cost me $1.99. <laughs> that only cost me $1.99 instead of $2.99 because I got some stupid free... I got so many free codes from Google. It's not even funny. And I used the uh, the Google app, 
when you can like write reviews on it and you get like pennies every single day. So I mean it's free money. I never I, I won't spend my money on this game. But we've got Pikachu on the squad, so let's check this out. I'm so glad I didn't start with Pikachu now. Pikachu, where you at? Um my bad, wrong team. And I also got to apply the surfboard. Because this is going to help. This is going to help me progress through the game, fam. Now, I'm not spending $30. Wait, where's... Oh, I got to click on Pikachu to actually get it. Okay. Hold up here. Pikachu, join the crew. What are the special moves that you... Why do you have to be level 1? You're making me go back into this game and leveling, fam. I don't like this. I don't mind it. I'm not going to hate Alright, what are the moves that you know? You know some cool moves. Power Charm you. What do you know? Oh, it's Surfing Pikachu. That's what it is. Oh my gosh. Thunder Shock and Surf. That is going to be... I gotta level up Pikachu soon. That's gonna be great. Now, if I go to the store... Go back to the, uh, the purchasing one... So you can purchase a bunch of stones. I got that one too. Where did you get yours from? Was it one of the events? So you can either purchase a bunch of stones for three bucks or get this huge expedition three pack bundle which has all the expedition packs in one. And when you buy all three kinds of expedition packs with ball models, uh, you can get a master ball model as a decoration. So that is pretty cool. We'll find out about that. If I can somehow... Yeah, I got mine from an event. Alright, sweet. Uh, decorations. Surfing peaks. Add it right there. Perfect. I, I remember that episode all too well. The Surfing Pikachu episode from the, uh, the first game. So that's pretty good. Expeditions, let's get into this again. Ooh, oh, shiny, you got that from an event too, right? Yeah, I got one. Alright, so, with that being said, our team is 1694, and this requires 1800. I don't think we're going to be able to do this just yet. We're going to have to keep stacking on um, PM tickets. And that shiny Tapu Koko event wasn't that much long ago. I'm going to try to do this again, and I'm going to go ahead and play it on auto, but I don't think we're going to be able to do this level. Um, we're going to have to wait until we get a couple more, or a decoration. Ooh, nice. Yeah, I don't think, yeah, I'm not going to be able to do this level. I'm looking at it right now. We're taking way too much damage and not doing enough. But we'll try it. We'll see what we can do here. And if that's the case, go ahead and uh, prepare for tomorrow's live stream. We're going to have to probably do some leveling. And I'll probably bring Pikachu along because Pikachu is really good. I'm surprised that it only costs $2.99. That was actually a pretty damn good deal. Fortnite does suck balls. I cannot stand it. It's just a game where people think it's not going to last long. Fortnite's going to die soon. What's great about it is playground mode though. Playground mode is actually the coolest thing in Fortnite right now. But they, it's not even out anymore. They got rid of it for the time being. And a lot of streamers and YouTube and content creators and Twitch streamers uh, that play Fortnite, they're not even like, they're not even having fun playing the game anymore. A lot of them created content during playground mode. They don't even play the game anymore. So it's gonna die. I'm happy about it. Hopefully something comes and takes over soon. And uh, yeah. It sucks. A lot of people play it mainly because it's like the thing to do, but hopefully it goes away soon. I, I, I ended up quitting for now because I just can't be bothered with it. I don't want to play something that I don't enjoy myself. Because if you're going to make content on YouTube, you got to want to enjoy it as well. And I'm enjoying playing a game that I don't have to play. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Oh my gosh. No, we got one more stage for stage two. Alright, my Pokemon needs some healing. It's actually a really good game, Sylveon, and they did a great way of advertising it. They got it into this, uh, the popular media, and they did a great... They just basically hooked onto it really well. They did Whoever ran the advertising and social media aspects of that game did a really good job on promoting it. They got tons of, like... They they basically went out of their way, like basketball, professional athletes, actors, actresses, people that... Some people don't even think they play video games. Now know that people play video games. And the, what they did with it is just 10 times better than any other game has done. But it is going to die soon. And we're all going to enjoy that. So we got a problem here. I'm facing off against three, four shelters and a cloister. We're attacking the cloister. That's not what we need to do here. We need to attack the shelters. Because the less enemies that we're fighting, the less damage we're all going to take. Oh, we just gang-banged on that shelter so hard. I think we just made a clam chowder out of that one. Okay, it's not... Okay, no. Eevee. M Maji. You know what sucks is, uh, Vulpix, you're facing off against, uh, shelter and you're not really doing too much damage here. Please kill it. Thank you. Eevee, I think we actually got this. I think the stones, the way I have my stones set up is helping my team out so much right now. Eevee's so OP when it comes up. Those stones, the legendaries, doing some bits. Yeah, we got this. It's just going to take a while, but we got this. Come on, squad. Eevee, keep using flail, please. It's your move. We don't need Growl anymore. Volpix got that debuff covered. Nice. There we go. But what do I know? The PC knows more than me. What's fun? This game or something else? This game's alright. It's not the I mean it's not amazing, but for a free to play game, this is pretty damn lit. Oh, Fortnite, yeah. And also Fortnite being free to play. That's just like why it's most popular. Cloister, stop healing, fam. Just die. Yes, okay, cool. We completed another stage. Wait, no. 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 Oh, I guess if I don't touch anything... It, okay, I get it. Ooh, the level up's here. Nice team. Nothing happened. I'm pretty sure I'm still alive. I think if I don't touch anything in a while, the the, the screen decides to like go on like a idle mode to save battery because I'm it doesn't think I'm doing anything. Quest. Challenge. What did we complete? I'm clicking it. Ooh, water investigation. Nice. Go back. Alright, so Expedition 1 fully completed, as you guys know. Expedition 2 and 3 currently sitting on bosses where I do not have the ability to complete at this moment in time. Expedition bonus, kind of got to wait on that. Um, PM tickets actually going up, which is nice. I'm not going to... Why would I do that? Why would I waste my PM tickets on battery life? I have yet to really need a reason to do that. <laughs> Decorations. I'm just seeing if anything gets added. Okay, cool. So that did get added. Again, the first uh, decoration I'm going to buy is that Mewtwo art. Looks super cool. Alright, let's get out of here. Still need, I believe, 125 PM tickets to get that. Alright, I'm going to have to back up. Got to remember to back up outside of the game or outside of the stream because it's actual personal information in order to back this game up. Let's see here. I'm basically going through everything to make sure I can't do anything else to go ahead and power up my team. 
there's ways I can continue, I will. Otherwise, we're going to have to do some, uh, go back in time and do some basic leveling. Level up some of the boys. Uh, not going to do any training. Level 1 Pikachu and Seal are actually pretty lit. I don't really want to get rid of those guys. Hit up. Hit up the stones. See if we got anything decent from that last one. So we did get a 112. Star you. Let's see. Get a 112 just sitting there. Switch you out. Eevee. You don't need it. Right? Perfect. Vulpix. Let's see if you need this. 191 comments today. Thank you all very much for tuning in. Uh, 107. Go ahead and switch that out. Perfect. This is like Pokemon Minecraft and Roblox mixed together. Oh, what's up, the lonesome artist? Thank you very much for tuning in. Yes, I absolutely agree. And it's 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 not an addicting game because it's not... I mean, there's a way to complete this game, but it is definitely fun. All right, let's hit up base camp. Not too much we can do here at Expeditions. All right, decorations just popped up because now we're at base camp. Not too much I can do there either. Ah, oh, man, double click. This game does lag a little bit. Let's go ahead and get back to base camp. I do apologize on that. All right, so at 1710, we were able to increase just a little bit. We're at 2 out of 5 on the cooking. I'm not going to waste any PM tickets on that. You know what? I'm just going to call them pokey tickets. PM doesn't sound right. But anyways... Since we do have to take a break right now because there's not too much we can do until tomorrow. Uh, thank you all very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the live stream. Stay tuned for some more content brought to you by Further Win Itachi. I will be back tomorrow.